Hi, Bill Edstrom here. In this video, I want to show you something about step clips. This is the velocity, how velocity works in step clips. And the way you set the velocity is when you're programming a step clip, it's basically when you turn these notes on and off per step, then the velocity gets set to 100% of whatever value you have set for the channel velocity. Hmm, does that make any sense? I'm not so sure. Let's just take a look at an example. We'll click on hi-hat. This is the channel. And then down in the channel, you see there's a channel velocity. Like here for the click, it's 96. For the snare, I've got it set to 70. I've got these set to different values. So this is basically the MIDI velocity that's going to be played for that channel for the various steps. So if I set this to, say, 90, then those will be a little bit louder. And then the in the velocity gate section, you're setting a percentage of up to 100% of this velocity. So if you want to take your hi-hat and give them kind of a little bit different, maybe emphasize the beats a little bit, you can draw in a scaling like this to just, if this is what you wanted to do, is to just scale down some of the notes so they're not all the same. Now, if you wanted to turn the entire channel down, then you could just reduce this. Let's just take it way down to 50. Or way up to 110. So this is how you scale per channel without having to go and change these sliders for each channel. Though you could do that if you want. If you want to take your open hi-hats down a little bit, you can adjust the scale of them right here, or you could just go here and then adjust this velocity setting. So this is the actual velocity, and this is a percentage of that velocity that you're actually going to use for each individual note on a step. In a step clip, this it's this column here is a step. Turning this on and off, this square is a note, and then the rows are channels. Thanks for watching.